Yeah, it's show off, man. Nope. Pop it, it's a show off. It's a show, it's a show off, it's a show off. You know what I'm saying? It's a nice little fool. It's a nice little. Today, I'm alone. Gloria taking a trip, though. She says she wants to rest, she wants to chill out, she wants to do her hair. Yeah, so I did today. Now, on the show today, we have this very interesting personality. You know, I have plenty of friends. I have plenty, plenty of friends. So I met this, this lady. She's the owner of Tarua, the head of Tarua. She's a producer. She's very, very spiritual. Like, she can see the visions. She sees things. She sees things. She sees things. She her. She is Lydia Bezin's sister in the building. We have her in the building. We have small talk. We have Poppy, Poppy. Yep. Poppy, why were you Bob Marley? She was the owner. Trying to, you know, someone's trying to imitate Bob Marley, so I'm just trying Who's to say. Who's there? Some guy they put on Linda saying Bob Marley has not been dead for a long time. It's so. all right, it's all right. We'll find out today, man. <laughs> it's the night show. We'll be right back with small talk. It's time for small talk. More claps, more claps, more claps, more claps. More clubs! Oh clubs! It's time for small talk. It's okay, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Now the first kiss we have today is in Canada. Now this beauty queen, who lied she had cancer. <laughs> she lied she had cancer and as she was going through cancer of the understand. I won't say it's both of the you get what I mean. And then they found out she was a fraud, Pope. <laughs> she was a fraud, she was caught that she didn't have no cancer. But this is a sad thing. All the money she used, she won, she had to return it. That's very, very bad. <laughs> and guess what? She has spent small of the money. Are you a Nigerian? It's only in Nigeria, those things happen. You understand what I mean? You fake cancer, the money you've saved is, you need to be, you have spent money, it has gone. Lady, that's bad. That's very, very bad. Number two, we have, um, now, Ciara fires back at Russell Simon with their son. Now, honestly, I'm, I'm a fan of Ciara. But then, y'all should take it easy, man. Y'all can't be McMillian and drinking right now, man. <laughs> and this is the reason why there's a son involved. Now, yes, we know you're not together, but then you chill. You don't go on Instagram talking plenty, plenty gist about your son's ownership. God owns your son. Finish. No one. <laughs> but then I understand that a mother's love for her child is important and blah, blah, blah. But you know what? Go off social media. Don't go there to, to vent your anger why people would always misinterpret and insult. That's what I think. Clap for me. Thank you. Now, this is what he said. Chloe Kardashian is my wife. Any man dating her is wasting his time. <laughs> Lamar, oh dumb. Now, this is very, let me show you Lamar. Now, how can, this is, this, this is, oh, I wanna get it, man. You broke up with a, with a girl how many years ago and you had a former wife. Now, <laughs> Young man, she has left you. She has gone. She's out of you. And she's like, no. No, I'm the. M oh, no, man. Chloe's gone. Honestly, Pope can marry Chloe. Chloe, Pope, do you like her? Mm-mm. Uh-uh. do you like her? You like her? He likes, and it's because in this life, girls, if there's no ring, there's no ring. <laughs> Take it. Now, a man goes to his father's grave, and he goes and he digs up the cops, and he argues with his father. <laughs> now, I'm not laughing because I understand the pain, but why would you do such a thing? You, you don't do that. This happened in America, and this is the anger. Daddy, you died and you left us with plenty of debt. <laughs> Daddy, come back, Daddy, come back. You do. <laughs> but it was not shy, but you get the point. Now, Fathers out there, please, before you die, try and pay your debt. <laughs> I'm not trying to be... Okay, I'm sorry if I... But do you get what I mean? Just pay, pay up. Let your kids just pay for the grave. Don't just... Sorry, man. A parrot in India was arrested recently. <laughs> Mr. Reason. She didn't poo on the streets? No, she didn't poo on the streets. She didn't enjoy any parrots? No. She insulted her owner. Ha, ha, ha! Recently... And she said, Ona, you don't feed me, right? <laughs> I'm joking. Now, I didn't get the specifics of the insults, but then she insulted her own and... 
Da, da, she got da. arrested. And they won't let her out. <laughs> but then I think, honestly, you don't do, how you do that to a pet? She's just a tiny, he's like, like Pope. You know, Pope is always talking nonsense. But I, I let him be. He, he's like, I'm a boy, I'm a boy. You know what I'm huh? Pope, I love you, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, a bride was dumped just before her marriage. That's sad. And this is the reason why. Because she told her husband, walking down the aisle, that she wants kids in the marriage. I said, huh? That wasn't the plan. But that's, that's so unfair. You don't do that. This happened in America. You don't, you don't do that to a woman. Why would you want to marry without having kids? I, I didn't get that gist. But hey, in Nigeria, they'll swear for you. They will insult your father and your mother and your family history. It's been small talk. Please send this to our mails and follow at Twitter at Cool TV Night Show. Up next, we have the spiritual one. The spiritual one. Lydia. Lydia. I mean, Lydia. Poppy. So, did you like what you just saw? I know you did. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. If you want to see more, just subscribe to our channel right now.